Uh, what's going on? I'm um, sorry. I've got to do it this way so I can actually see what I'm doing. But I decided to go with a lighter weight tent this year. Um, I want to try this out. This is the Gossamer gear. Um, sorry, our rooster is a little crazy. But this is the one. Uh, it's ultra lightweight. It's. I think it came out to like three pounds lighter than the one that I'm using now. I'm just using a. Uh, Alps Mountaineering um, Chaos One, I believe it was, that I picked up, and that's been working really well. Um, with everything said, uh, fly everything. It's right around five pounds, um, and this comes out to, if I'm not mistaken, just over two pounds, roughly. And I mean, it's super, super small, really lightweight. I opted for the poles that come with it. You can shorten them down like that. So overall, the length is smaller than my tent that I've been using. Um, I also have a two person that I've been using as well, which is the 6AM Outdoors CC Divide. Um, but literally just got this in and I am going to see if I can't throw it up for you guys so you get a real life um, example of going through it so back up just a bit so I already popped these two up got the bag here take it out now it says that it comes with some steaks here's some steaks right here And I have not done this at all with this tent. I've literally just opened it up to show you guys and see how I'm gonna do this. All right, so there's that. watched videos on it online how to set it up and that is literally all I've done Let's see how to do it so got the two ends there comes with Give me seven stakes, a couple guy lines. So take this. Grab the two more from the ends, grab the pole that says to do the back first. This is up here. And so there's a pocket up top. And down here there's a little clip. And so these are sided. You got the flat spot up in the pocket. And we'll close this bottom here.
that looks like it's it. This is twisted. But there we go. Beautiful. Pretty simple. I took it off, it turned off uh, the videoing, but you can see, real simple to make. There's these here. Put through, kind of hard to do one handed, but. I guess it's hard to do two-handed too. Like that. Put that here. And this is much more spacious than, sorry, I'm trying to get this squared away for you guys. Give me one second, sorry. The vestibule is way more spacious than my Alps Engineering. These you can stake down the corners of the tent here. Trying to do this one hand is not the best way. But so you guys I opted for not getting the um, flooring. I have some Tyvek tarp that I'm going to be utilizing instead. I keep that in my pack anyways, so um, I'm going to be using that and I can just take it with me if I need it for any sort of shelter or anything, but I keep that for laying meat on typically and I'll just utilize um, that for this. And then also I have another little uh, tarp that I use from 6A M Outdoors um, for me, but you can see it hit the guy line to push this up a little bit. I'm six and I got about I don't know, four or five inches right here. Pull the guy line out and I'll have a lot more, but so far so good. And this is a lot of space in here. <laughs> 